heading up the hill. Saw the cows grazing. I thought this would be a good spot for our next question. Which comes from Susie Thomas. Congrats on the one year. I hope many more to come. What is your career goal? And I don't know. This has been my problem pretty much my entire life. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. And when I first started going to school, it was to do electrical engineering. I should have stuck with it, but I didn't. And then I went, dropped out, went back to school to do rad tech technician, radiology technician. Um, MRIs, CT scans, x-rays. Should have stuck with that, but I didn't. Dropped out of school, went back. I'm currently doing either accounting, business marketing, and we'll see how that, how long that plays out. Um, but that's kind of what I'm shooting for at the moment. Um, dream vacation. I have always wanted to go to Japan ever since I was, oh man, just a kid. I don't know why, but I always wanted to go to Japan. I hear it's hella expensive, but I figured it'd be really, really cool. My dream car or dream bike? The dream bike right now at the moment is the Kawasaki H2R. And that is a sleek, mean, street fighting machine. It just looks like a fighter jet on wheels, man. It is intense. So dream car, dream car, man, I don't know. But when I was a kid, I used to like like Mustang 5.0s and that was just like a, a little phase. And after that, I grew in love with like a 76 Stingray. Just because of the curves on that car, man, it's just sexy looking. So maybe like a Corvette would probably be my midlife crisis car. But to go really, really high end, I don't know. I'd probably pick like, I think Porsche has a super hybrid along with BMW, Lamborghini, Ferrari. But the Porsche looks pretty sick. Um, I don't know, I don't know. But I know what bike it is, and that's the Kawasaki H2R. Have you ever been or driven in any other countries? I have been to Mexico. I went to Puerto Vallarta for a few weeks as a vacation. And a buddy of mine, Thomas and I, actually took a road trip from California up to Portland, Oregon, and it kept going up to Washington, Seattle, Washington. And then he was actually in the army at the time, so he had a check-in um, port for duty. I rented a car and kept going up into Vancouver, British Columbia, and spent like a night or two there. It was a really, really short trip. I wish I could have spent more time. Um, but out of the country, those are the only places I've gone so far. Um, our next question, let's do one more. The cows is kind of a nice, pretty sight. Um, Smoky Bar, nice one matey. Question, if you won the lottery, what would be your first three purchases? First three purchases, a few houses. Buy a house for me, the mom, take care of my family, make sure they're set up. Um, so buy a few properties so that everybody's taken care of. And probably little things like a couple of cars, maybe a truck to haul a scooter around, um, a nice, simple, everyday commuter, maybe get that Corvette. I don't know if that's an everyday commuter, but... Um, and then the third purchase... I don't know. I mean, if we're not just screwing off and just spending our money at parties and at clubs and hotels and Vegas and stuff like that, the third purchase would probably just to, like, make a little investment pick up a bond or something, get paid on some interest, live off the interest, um, and then just play around with whatever interest, then have the big chunk there towards the end for whatever comes up. Vacation to Japan, a trip to Italy, Spain. Spain would be cool to go to. Um, if you guys haven't checked out Smokey Bar's channel, um, he's a UK moto vlogger, started on a Vespa, he's got a motorcycle now, it's got that great British humor, which I don't get because I'm from California. <laughs> but uh, he's a cool guy. He's a cool guy. He's been there from the beginning. I dig him. Um, say goodbye to the cows. Let's see if we can get to the top of the hill. 
and check out what the view looks like. Find the emission source and destroy it.